Hello again guys, this is Austin Mega Smash here, and today we are going to be playing Zenobia 3. Alright, there. I want this in focus. There we go, okay, that's good enough. That's actually really good. <laughs> okay, so, we're gonna play this. And, you can actually download this game free, here you know what, I'm gonna show you first. You can actually download this game free off of the Android market. It's actually in the top free apps, I believe. You know what, screw it, we're just gonna do this. Bam, right there, and it's free. It is a free download. You get the whole game. Yeah. Come on, what's the blade? Yeah. Okay, so let's get to the gameplay. <laughs> now I've been playing this a little bit, and the controls aren't the best, but they're all right. So I guess we're just going to start a new game. There's my guy that I was using earlier. Uh, let's see. To be the sword knight. Melee class wielding the finest sword. Tenacious. To be agile. Shadow hunter. Melee class favoring swift claw attacks. Mechanic launcher, fusion, long range class, firing deadly mechanical weapons. Mature shaman, mystical long range class, who uses natural magic and totem. We're going to use this guy, because he's honestly my favorite. It's so between these two guys. Now, I haven't played this game very much. I only played up to, like, the second quest. So... We're gonna do the Shadow Hunter, because he's cool. To watch the intro. Yes. And this is a long time ago, lower ranked knights, blah 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 blah. You don't really need to care about that. See, I probably won't read you those because they go kind of fast. You can read it for yourself. <laughs> the time is approaching for us to return to the heavenly realm. I will show you how to incompetent and powerless your gods are. Brave warriors of the Devil Tribe, charge! Ruthless Devil Tribe, how dare you intrude! Guardians of the Holy Divine Tribe, rise up and show your majestic power! Charge! Arrah. I think the that's the last time I'll read, actually. <laughs> now, this is a pretty long intro, so... Yeah. Just beware. Ah, oh, he's dead.
Okay, so this is the first out of the Zenioa games, or I don't know how to pronounce it, that I've actually played. So, I wanted to know if this game was like on the NES or the Game Boy or something. I know that the first one is on the DS, that you can buy it off of uh, the shops, the DSi shop or the eShop, depending on what you're using. But leave in the comments below telling me what this was originally for. Yeah, it's before us appeared. Yeah, I just hit us appear. What are you gonna do about it, huh? No, that's not us, by the way. Okay, here we go. Time, finally time for some action. Here's how we move. You can change this thing right here and take your tap. Go do this. Like I said, I don't really like these controls all that much. The main reason why I want to know what system this was originally for is so that if it was for system, I could get the emulator on my computer and be able to actually show you that without these annoying controls. But, you know, whatever. It's just fine to them. Go to the kingdom. Leave from it.
Hey, more talking. Yeah, that was the first mission, guys. That was our first quest. Okay. And here's our next one. Okay, so we just leveled up, now we are level 2. Look at our little badass guy right there. Okay, so let's uh, put this stuff together. We're going to add 1 to our strength, 1 to our dexterity, and 1 to our cons to whatever that word is. I don't know how to pronounce that. I suck at pronouncing stuff. Okay, and that's where the video is going to end. Check you guys in the next video for part 2. Peace.